Hey guys, here I am with my 1964 uh, V8 powered Volkswagen small block Chevy, 355 cubic inches, uh, 350 turbo, 3500 converter, 9 inch forward rear end uh, on ladder bars. It is a custom tube chassis car. This is not an S10. Uh, this is not a Ford Ranger or anything like that. Uh, car's been built since about 06. Car's held up very well. Car's built right. Car drives like a little street ride. It's not really a drag car. It is more of a street ride than anything, but she is lightweight and she is pretty fast. I uh, just thought I'd have her opened up. I've done some videos of the car in the garage that doesn't really do the car justice. This car's kind of caged up in there. So I thought I'd walk around the car. I did a little wipe off on it. It's January here in Louisville, Kentucky. It's been really cold lately. Today it is a lot warmer. So, of course, you got your aluminum radiator. Has an electric fan on the outside pushing, and then you have a mechanical fan inside pulling. Chrome alternator, chrome water pump, aluminum valve covers, uh, energy style breather on it. Uh, new Holly carburetor on it is a 750 double pump. All AN fittings. A lot of low car stuff on this car. A lot of braided lines on this car. Uh, you can see my other video underneath the car. The car's just as nice underneath as it is on top. Uh, paint's been on it since 07, probably. I'm not sure of the date on that, but uh, paint has held up very well. Extremely presentable. Not perfect, but extremely presentable. This is not no Earl Shab paint job or anything like that. New door panels. Lincoln LS power tilt telescopic steering column in it. Uh, pretty neat. Some of you guys that ain't as tall as me. Uh, makes you lean back a little bit there. All pro comp. Ultralight gauges in it. Those are switches for your tilt and telescopic and your headlights. Hidden stereo in the console. New pro car seats in it. Low car shifter. Wildwood brake pedals in it. Carpet's nice. Headliner's nice. Speakers in the back. Little trap door to get down in the back of the car. Car is on 2810.5s. They're not a W, but they are a drag. They are a... It is a new set of tires on this car. They uh, just put them on last year. Uh, I'm not sure the style of wheel, uh, the brand of wheel on it. It is a Halibrand five window copy. Uh, it's got LED tail lights in it under some stock style bug tail lights, blue dots. Exhaust comes out in the normal location, three and a three inch. Uh, fuel cells bolted down on it. Custom built, new, high dollar. <laughs> I think it's 12 gallons. Your fuel pump, more braided lines, your vent, all splatter painted nice in the trunk. Your battery's hidden under there. Like I said, this car's been in my garage trying to shoot some of these videos, let you guys see it. Uh, you don't really get the essence of the pop that it actually has. Fiberglass dash in it. Uh, looks like that's a, a door, but it's actually the choke to the car. If you guys are just looking, uh, you know, give me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. I'm very new to YouTube. I just learned a couple weeks ago how to post a video. <laughs> Wipers on it. They work. You got your, uh, what I like about the 
early 60s Volkswagens is this recessed headlight with a glass dome over the top, kind of Porsche style. Uh, does got a H, uh, HID headlights in it, aftermarket. Vents here. Let's try to get some air in the car. They're cut out real nice. I mean, that's done really nice on the car. Pretty cool. Cool little feature on it. VIN is in the, uh, I'm sure you've seen me walking around the video. The VIN is uh, hidden there in the door on it. And she does got a VIN. She does have a 1964 VIN that goes to this car all matches on the title clear title clean title no liens no loans figure we'd button her up car is a not running the car is a sleeper and she uh she buttons up like a little bug here you know You know, it is all 1964. Uh, fiberglass fenders, fiberglass running boards. You know, buttoned up the car. It just looks like a little California style lowered slam bug. Like I said, it's not a race car. There's no cage in this car. It's never had a cage in it. I don't know what it runs. It's been at the, never been at the track. It's not beat on or abused. We do play with it. It's fun to pick on some unsuspecting people, you know. But I really don't have a clue what it run. You guys are wondering that. Uh, the ET drags are on it mainly for the appearance. I just like the way that they fit over a standard radial tire. They just really fit in that fender wheel, so. Well, like I said, give me a thumbs up. Uh, car is for sale. I am very firm on the price at $22.5. I believe that's a steal on this car. Yeah, there's other V8 bugs. Yeah, there's cheaper V8 bugs. But uh, they're not done to this caliber. This car is very well engineered. Very well sorted out. Drives like a little go-kart. Rides good. Drives good. So... You can give me a call if you want. Uh, I'm not a dealer. It's 502-341-5102. My name's Bobby. And, uh, I appreciate you guys taking a look at my little video.